Cal Ripken here, Bill Ripken here. Uh, I want to try to improve your uh, hitting. Uh, in this particular drill, we're going to use the one-handed bat. Okay, uh, you can use it with the bottom hand, which is what I prefer, or you can use it with the top hand uh, as well. Top hand is more for strength, bottom hand is more for the directing the path of the uh, bat to the baseball. And the sensation you want to feel here is like you're backhanding this uh, ball right here. Okay, so when you put the bat in your hand, you're going to backhand the ball in there. It's really important. By using this bat, you know, it's light enough where you're not going to get into bad habits of kind of drifting um, like some people use their, their regular bat on a one handed drill. Small bat here, get down on the handle. If you have to choke up just a little bit, more control of the bat, that's fine. But the sensation is going to be to backhand the ball, to backhand the ball. Okay, let me demonstrate. Um, as in soft toss, most, most things in soft toss, you want to have a nice firm base. We're not working on our stride or our body position. We're working on our hands. So get in this, this position, release this hand off the ball, bam, and hit it that way. Backhand the ball, bam, backhand the ball. Ooh. <clears throat> this, uh, this really starts to direct um, the uh, bat directly to the ball. Some people will say, you know, it helps you stay inside the ball. Sometimes that's a little confusing. If you do this drill and then you get back in and take uh, batting practice, you'll feel you're, you're going to be a little shorter to the ball. One more time here. Boom. And real quickly, if you want to do the, uh, the strength hand, because this is your strength hand that helps produce the bat speed, good for younger hitters to start to develop overall strength. Same sort of concept in this position. And then come down through the ball that way. And one word of caution, you want to make sure you have the right grip on here so your wrist can roll through the swing. You don't want to be holding it so tight where it rolls over. Right here in your fingers so the wrist rolls. Ready? Boom. Boom. Uh, do we have time for uh, one of you guys to uh, give it a try? Who hasn't taken a swing yet? We'll go back to the beginning. All right, first we're going to use the bottom hand. Use the bottom hand for this one. And again, the sensation is backhanding it this way. Boom, down through it. Well done. And that's for directing the bat head uh, to the path of the baseball. All right, now let's try the top hand one. Um, remember, you got to have the right grip on this one so your uh, wrist can roll. This is the harder of the two. That's all right. Adjust your hand position. You'll get the hang of it. And in a real simple way, you're just breaking down the responsibility of both your hands on the swing. Um, there's been a few routines in the big leagues where guys like to use both the bottom hand and the top hand drill. Um, I've seen it mostly with just the bottom hand, but uh, this one develops uh, strength. It's a good hitting tool to start to develop uh, what each hand is supposed to do on the baseball bat.